Okay. Well, uh, this, uh, this project uh, definitely... Now I remember what Web3 was. Yeah, and this takes me to Bog Swap. I guess a lot of people are shitting on Pancake Swap for some reason. I still like Pancake Swap. But I guess maybe they're considered a little too... Uh, mercenary, right? Because pancake swap, you know, you know, every like two, three months, they always dump all their Titano tokens for whatever reason. But I mean, that's just how it goes. I mean, you know, pancake swap, you know, has to pay the bills too, you know. So it's just, it's just how it goes. So anyway, I've been uh, getting this, uh, this, I've been getting this as a request a lot. So I finally got around to this, and just by looking at the price chart, because I don't know anything about this project, because. You know me, I do a little bit of research, but I generally prefer to do it on stream because it's much more important that all of you understand why I do things and how I think because that's way more important because I know I got a couple of comments asking me, how do I know, what, what, how do I invest in some projects and how do I, how, and some others I don't. I actually don't really have a good answer for that, right? Because I look at the fundamentals, if it's a tomb fork especially, you know how I always talk about the smart APR system, right? Because that's generally a requirement, right? But basically, I just try to look at, okay, is the project sustainable or not? That's ultimately what I'm looking at, all right? And how is it sustaining itself, right? And there's like a million different factors. So there's always something in common that I have to look for, right? And I also generally do not like buying tokens that are this expensive. Right now, it's like $174, $175 a piece, right? This is the reason why I didn't buy Seifu. Which is great because Seifu, you know, got hit pretty hard with a Certic Arctic BS and then now they're doing okay. Right? You can still do this. I personally don't. This is another reason why I don't buy shares anymore in a tomb fork. Right? How would you like to go from four hundred dollars to like twenty bucks? Right? How do you think that how do you think that feels? Or I do the peg, right? Just just you know, because having the highest APY is not always the best move, right? You want a very high APY, yes, but it's gotta be safer, right? Because there's already a lot of price uh, price decrease risk. Let me just look at this. What if you bought the top of Web3 when it was like $227.61, right? I'm rounding up a little. Then you go all the way down here, all right? It's actually not that bad c compared to a lot of cryptos, but still a pretty big drop, you know? Which is the one I deal with, you know? Okay, I think that's Renzo, actually. Okay, yeah. All right. Yeah, I've got a lot to do. So... Uh, so let's see, Web3, I assume this is the Web3 because when I went, because I don't actually know whatever the thing is, so this is the only thing that shows up on Tomb Fork Watch, right, XYZ, and then, yeah, but then when I click here, because this, this thing hasn't been updated yet, but when I click here, this is where it takes me, so, so I, and I think this is the right one, because I do remember this thing is every three seconds, I'm kind of surprised they're not hogging up all the freaking gas on on uh, <laughs> Binance Smart Chain, but maybe they have like a bunch of tokens. I, I don't know how they do it, but yeah. Okay, anyway, low risk backed by auto buybacks and I guess their treasury. Interest is paid every three seconds, which I think is way too excessive. I mean, I you can do like every one minute, I guess. And of course you can vote, <laughs> vote in a so-called democracy and then take some revenue from all their utilities so you get a you basically get some sort of voting rights and profit sharing rights so which is cool i don't know if that's out yet okay uh they have a pretty nifty looking website i mean i'm not a fan of the color all right but that's just personal preference all right but still looks nice still looks nice uh, okay, so they're going to, uh, you know, show their thing on the App Store. I think Titano is actually on the uh, App Store, too, right? Google Play, at least, and then Web3. This is also kind of nice because Web3 is obviously a, a pretty highly searched term on search engines, especially Google, right? So this actually helps with their SEO and uh, whatchamacallit, you know. Yeah, so when people type in Web3, you might someday, those people might someday want to see the Web3 product. Like, hey, what is this? All right. So it's actually very smart. Uh, it's actually a very smart SEO naming branding decision by the Web3 devs. Okay. Oh, man. I really hope there's no not for safe kind because I didn't see that. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this is okay. Just I'm just browsing real quick. Yeah, this is fine. But, you know, I really don't like not for not safe for work shit. 
Okay, so you can invest. All right, so there are your taxes. Let me move it down. Ah, this is very annoying, right? You can see it right here. This is very annoying. Okay, so... All right, I'm just going to do this. F it. Yeah, it's not covering anything. My stupid social thing. Okay, you got the black hole. You got auto liquidity engines. And... Oh, that's kind of cool. Web3 Healthy Auto Liquidity Engine. Well, they have Web3 Auto Staking Protocol, Wasp. So these guys are... Whoever actually is in charge of this, or they have someone that does this, is very good with, uh, you know, SEO and branding, and then um, acronym naming. This is actually really smart. I'm sure, I know there's a term to describe that type of person, but at least here in the United States, we always have, like, these stupid acronyms when they create new uh, bills or acts. I don't know what that's called, but they obviously have someone like that on here. So that's actually very good. I appreciate that too, because remember, I used to work as an actor, right? Background actor too. And I know a lot about Hollywood screenwriting and all that stuff too. So, which I haven't really been able to do much in a long time. But and I would like to go back to it, because I really do enjoy creative things like acting and making movies and stuff. So, you know, because I made a movie a long time ago. I guess now it's a long time ago. I would like to get back into it, you know? So anyway, it's a good money too, a good business, if you can do it correctly. And of course, you know, you meet a lot, like if you're a man or woman, you meet a lot of attractive people of the opposite sex, all right? So in my case, obviously, I meet a lot of good-looking women. So it's a nice way to meet women. Of course, they tend to be more, you know, liberal-minded, so you got to make sure you get them to forgive mom and dad and then do the silent prayer so they'll stop being like, you know, like falling for all the scams that are going on right now. I'll leave it at that. But anyway... That is pretty funny, the WTF fun. <laughs> funny. So, yeah, I kind of like this. I, 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 this probably is cool simply because the, the, it, clearly they're very smart, they're very creative. That right there makes it actually really good. Okay, and, they're, and then also you can see their creativity because they're obviously doing. They also have, uh, they have an artist, a really good graphics artist, right? And they're doing like NFT stuff. Okay, so own an exclusive NFT collection that will interact with the ecosystem. One of a kind avatar creator where every piece features a bonus like reduction in transaction tax. So I assume this obviously better be very limited. Trade on our marketplace or put it up for rent and earn passive income from your unique digital asset value. So this is pretty cool. Uh, I don't wanna I don't I wanna try to keep these videos short, but you can, you know, click this thing if you want to learn more, but Okay, so that's pretty cool. Once you have this NFT, you can just dump it, right, and get big capital gains payday, hopefully. Or you can rent it out and then just get, I guess, a portion of the uh, income from that forever. So that's actually kind of cool. This is actually like how virtual real estate will work, right? Because that's something I'm very interested in, but it, I, I want to wait till it's more simple and like, you know, all the smart people in the world, like, figure out how to really streamline it. So that'll be it'll be just as easy in virtual NFT land to buy real estate as it is in real life, right? Hey, just have a lot of money, buy it, and then get rental income, right? Get passive income, and that'll be that, right? So you just get free money forever, right? And then you'll have then you'll have an additional hedge against inflation because obviously you know this is gonna this isn't gonna stop, right? All right? The Federal Reserve always lies. All central banks are liars, all right? Uh, yeah, it's still going up. It's still going up. I just moused over it. I have a message from someone. Oh man, I'll, I'm never gonna get through. Uh, I, I, I'm never gonna get through anything, man. This is a spammer. Yeah. Oh. This is a APY Web three. Oh, okay. So I actually got confused with a different product. This is a different. I got this from a spammer. Uh, this is on BSC. Okay. All right. There's something not right with this. There's an APY Web 3. Okay, hold on. Yeah, APYWeb3.com. This was what people were requesting. Their site also looks a lot uglier, too. Uh, yeah. Okay, so, all right, this isn't a launch yet, but they do have a pink sale, so. Yeah, I'm going to close this DM. 
Okay, so I actually got... Alright, so there's already... Okay, so I got... I don't know if I want to get tricked, because this is obviously not the right one, but this is a different Web3. So there's actually two different versions of Web3. Okay, so basically everyone's copying each other, so... <laughs> All right, well, I added the content queue because that's another project I can cover because everybody wants these things too, right? They want Seifu forks, they want Titano forks, and to a lesser degree, Tomb forks, which I really like. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, so... All right, Alpha Test is live. All right, so you can check that out. So I guess their game's out. Best to come, you're in this guy. So stake on the DAO and earn X Web 3 governance tokens if you're into voting. Omega oh, lol, you're in the voting. <laughs> you're, you think your vote counts. <laughs> it does count on the web, but it doesn't count in real life. Not nearly as much. That's why nothing ever changes in countries. But it's changing. It's going to change because crypto and blockchain tech is going to fix it. You know, well, that and you also have people like St. Nick, you know, not just here in America, but throughout the whole world, you know, trying to take back the country through, through the government. So participate in events blah, blah blah we build it you join it great and pretty cool website okay so i definitely like this site it's doing very well I, I, it definitely deserves its little thing here so apparently there's i was told apy web 3 but i thought that was this project so but that's actually two separate projects now so let's see uh yeah it's yeah there's the web 3 project i don't know why it says there's a word web in here oh website is gone and website link to their thing okay so apy web 3 which i'm not going to show on this thing because i mean they have a pink sale and they've been audited by pink sale so it's probably fine but it's about to go live in like 20 minutes so it's like yeah whatever i, I don't really care uh, my money is already stretched thin as it is, and I don't want to be taking profit from Caesar and Sphere, all right? Because I have to still let it grow as quickly as possible, as long as possible, and then I got pulled money. I'd be forced to sell a little bit so I can pay my bills. So, okay. Uh, uh one. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Let me check. Yes, I have one. Yes, yes. Thanks, bro. I got it. Yeah. I'm still in the middle of a video recording right now. Uh, I'll check after I'm done. But yes, one USDC is in my wallet. Okay. All right. So yeah. Sorry. So I'm gonna put uh, APY Web3 on the back burner. I want to wait till they launch. Obviously. Uh, I guess you could check this for liquidity lock and whatever, but just by looking at this, this looks pretty legit to me. And the dev obviously created this pair a long time ago, essentially a long time ago. So they already thought ahead. So they obviously just created the contract one month, 20 days ago. Obviously they didn't do anything with it, right? So they at least get rid of the 24 hour liquidity warning here. And then they obviously told everyone the contract event uh, address when it went live and added liquidity. You know, and here and here we are. So, I'm personally not going to invest in this, right? Because again, it's just too expensive. But it will probably be okay, right? So just you know, again, do more of your own research, right? And of course, don't risk all your money, right? Just do a little bit, as always. Uh, but yeah, definitely check these guys out. They definitely seem to be uh, pretty good. I didn't check their Twitter or Discord at all, cause whatever. I don't plan on doing whatever, so. But they definitely seem uh, they definitely seem like they know what they're doing, and they obviously have a real uh, they hired either outsourced or hired a really good web designer. And look, like this is just this is insane. I didn't even notice this floating cat across the screen, right? As I move the scroll bar up and down, that, that that's insane. Oh, that's a cat mask. Oh yeah, see it's up there too on this lady too. Yeah, so this definitely looks quite promising. So I, yeah, no wonder there's already a copycat of this, right, by APY Web. <laughs> they don't realize though that they just because these guys have all this crap going on too. So, all right, anyway, check out the Web Three project. That's the name of this project. I will see you in the next one, which is 
Uh, I gotta do Dark Crypto Finance because I don't wanna. I still wanna do Tomb Fork, so I haven't like all my like last several videos have all been Titano Seifu forks, which is great. But I wanna make sure we get a mix because the daily because the one thing that Tomb Forks are really good at is providing very good daily income, right? From from the investor point of view, from the developer point of view, it's more about creating demand for a token, right? Which is what Poseidon Black is trying to do. So let's see, AP by Web3. Okay, yeah. So I'll see you in the next one. It'll be a Tomb Fork called Dark Crypto Finance. I have no idea what that is. I also have to talk to Renzo right now. That's who's DMing me. I'm gonna take care of something real quick. And then uh, yeah, check out the check out the, the this thingy, right? But uh, you know, Safeway's got a lot of problems right now, but they're doing all right. I or the last time I checked a couple hours ago, they're price price wise. But this, I mean, maybe, you know, maybe you want to add, a, maybe if you're really in a safe food, maybe you want to do something like this too. But me personally, uh, I'm not going to invest in this. There's already plenty of other projects, but yeah. Also, three seconds, man. Every three seconds. That's really excessive, but yeah, that's just me. Like, subscribe, share the videos around, grow this channel, blah, blah, blah. We are, all right, don't keep this info to yourself, right? Because, you know... You all get richer if you are more generous and not a selfish asshole, right? And again, to all you new people, thank you for uh, joining the channel. So it's gonna be pretty nice. It's gonna be pretty nice. Right? In fact, is Bitcoin broken 45k yet? Yeah, they're encountering resistance, but this thing is already way higher than it should be. So and it's going much higher. All right, cryptocurrencies are going much much higher. So oh yeah, look at that. Look at that buy. Oh, uh, what's a good? Yeah, I'm sure YouTube will pick a good picture. See you next video. Thanks.